What is going on, y'all? Travis here, back with more Supernatural. This is going to be Season 3, Episode 9. Let's go. That was just a terrible, terrible party. <laughs> but there was this one really beautiful woman there. Who? You should have gone home with her. Her? I did. She is beautiful, mm -hmm. isn't she? Ooh. I need a few minutes. All right. Look, Madam Fieda. Markoch. Madam Fieda. Madam Fieda. Fiachushi. Shade Morluan. Ew. Madam Fieda. Fiachushi. Shed Morluan, Kih il Tolk, in del Bolk. Okay, that is terrifying. What is it? It's my teeth. Help me! Durkianev, Kih il Tolk. That is terrifying. Ew. Coughing up all your teeth, sisters. She was so scared. Ew. I couldn't help. I couldn't do anything to stop it. And I I've talked to the police, and no one can explain it. Well, that's why they put the call into us, Mr. Dutton. Mr. Dutton, did Janet have any enemies? I'm sorry? Anyone that might have had a reason to hurt her? Well, I mean, what kind of person? Maybe. You think a person could have done this? Would anyone want to? Maybe. No, there's, there's no one that could have... Do you have a jealous ex? Mr. Dunn? Uh, everyone loved Janet. Everyone? Okay, thank you very much. I think we've got everything we need. We'll get out of your way now. That dude seemed a little evasive to you. I don't know. I was under a sink. Hell yeah. Check this out. Hex bag. Oh, gross. Yeah. There are bird bones, rabbit's teeth. This cloth is probably cut from something Janet Dutton owned. So we're thinking which? Uh, yeah, but this is old world black magic, Dean. I mean, warts and all. I hate witches. They're always spewing their bodily fluids everywhere. Pretty much. It's creepy. You know, it's downright unsanitary. Someone definitely had it out for Janet Dutt. So what are we thinking? We're uh, looking for some craggy old Blair bitch in the woods? No, it could be anyone. A <laughs> neighbor, co-worker, man, woman. That's a problem, Dean. They're Blair human, like bitch. everyone else. Great, how are we going to find them? Someone in Janet Dutton's <laughs> life had an ugly action. I love it. We find the motive. We find the murderer. Blair bitch. Hey, Amanda. Oh, Elizabeth, hi. Sorry, I've got like a thousand things on my mind. I mean. You didn't come to book club last night. Yeah, sorry, I was going to call. I just, I got busy, you know. But I'm fine, really. I am. Thanks. I think you're lying. What the fuck? Ew. That's disgusting. Oh. Dinner was cooked for you, Paul Arthur Dutton. Now you're going to eat it. Ew, ew. Put a spell on you. That is so disgusting. Uh. Oh! Oh! <coughs> Take the car, Sam. Got it. Oh. 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 How you like that? Your turkey exploded. Haha. -ha. You okay? Someone murdered your wife, and now they're trying to kill you. That's impossible. There's no way. Well, if we hadn't been following you, you'd be a doornail right now. Now, who wants you dead? There's a, there's a woman? Uh, okay, a woman. Well, okay. An affair, an, a, a mistake. She was unbalanced. She was blackmailing me, and I, I put an end to it a week ago. What's her name? What could she have to do oh, with what? what is her name? She evil. She evil as hell. i put maggots in his burger. What's all the fuck? Um, um, what the fuck? Uh, 
That's a curveball. Yeah. Three per wrist. Vertical. She wouldn't fool it around. That is so disgusting. Ew. Yeah. Looks like she was working some heavyweight evil here. Yep. Oh, God. Freaking witches. Seriously, man. Come on. What Paulson knows how to pick them on? It's like fatal attraction all over again. Yeah. Why does a rabbit always get screwed in the deal? Poor little guy. <laughs> Poor you know what I don't brother. get, Dean? If she was so bent on revenge, why do this? She got Janet Dudden, thought she finished off Paul, decided to cap herself and make it a spurn lover's hat trick. Nah, nah, Maybe. nah, nah, nah. Y'all know I mean, it, it can't be exactly that easy. It's like the TV room of a bright and stable person, you know? But then, there's this. Another hex bag? Come on. Looks like we got a hit, huh? Little witch on witch violence. I'd like to report a dead body. Oh. 309 Mayfair Circle. Okay. My name? Yeah, sure. My name is. <laughs> Just my name you. is. Fuck off. I think maybe we got a coven on our hands. My name is Kick Rocks and Eat Dirt. I'm going. I'm not fooled by your little book club, by the way. It's all dish and gossip. <laughs> I mean, when's the last time anyone actually brought a book? Good night, Ron. He doesn't know? You didn't tell him about Amanda? Oh, I think that's book club business, don't you? Mm. Please just took away her body, and what, we're just gonna pretend it didn't happen? We loved Amanda. It's true. We know that she was a little unstable. Spell books. Also true. She probably killed Janet Dutton. We have to stop. Spell start. book club. Calm down. We can't stop. But people are dying. <laughs> But that's all over now. Think about what book club has gotten us. Your husband's promotion? That little trip to Hawaii that you won? Do you want to stop? Uh-huh. Now, come on. We don't have much time. Ron gets back from his fantasy football in an hour. Oh, fantasy football. Fun times, fun times. Book of Shadows. That damn book, book of, of shadows. shadows. We kneel before you. You must have a green thumb. Excuse me? Getting these herbs to grow out a season like this. I'm uh, Detective Bachman. This is Detective Turner. We're following up on Amanda Burns' death. But didn't she? I mean, she killed herself, right? Maybe, maybe. Do you have any idea of better practices? I'm sorry, what, what kind of practices? She well, looks see, her house was littered with super Satan. familiar. Yeah, the regular Black Sabbath. But she was an Episcopalian. <laughs> Elizabeth, uh, Renee, these are detectives. You can tell that Elizabeth is a little upset. Of course, Miss. Mrs. Oh. Renee Van Allen. Would you like me to spell it for you? Oh, goodbye. Thanks. This Amanda business has been hard for Liz. I, I mean, you think you know a person. Well, thanks. Um, we'll be in touch. Have a nice day. Bye. You evil looking lady. Van Allen. I'm already sold on that Elizabeth chick. You see that victory garden of hers? Belladonna, Wolf's Bane, Mandrake. Well, she's definitely had a good run lately. Won almost too many raffles. Kind of thing a little black magic always helps with. Mrs. Renee Van Allen has won almost every craft contest she's had in the past three months. I'm thinking that was the coven we met back there, minus one member. Amanda was clearly going off the reservation. If they killed the nut job, should we uh, thank them or what? They're working black magic too, Dean. They need to be stopped. Van Allen. Stopped like stopped? The humans, eh? Yeah, the like stop, bro. Gots to stop them. Burn which burn. What the hell? Oh. Oh. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Ruby. Sam, listen to me. You have to get out of town. So this is Ruby, huh? Never had the pleasure. Dean. I was hoping you'd show up again. Point that thing somewhere else. <laughs> right. Get in the car and don't look back. Hey, hot stuff. We could take care of a few kitchen witches, thanks. I'm not talking about witches, you jackass. Witches are whores. I'm talking about who they serve. Oh, they get the power from demons. Yeah. Sam, it knows you're in town, and it's going to come after you, and it's way more than you can handle. Please tell me you're not listening to this crap. Put a leash on your brother, Sam, if you want to keep him. She's messing with your head. God knows why. That's who they are. I'm telling you the truth. And I'm telling you to shut up, bitch. Why are you even a part of this conversation? Oh, I don't know. Maybe because he's my brother, you black-eyed skank. And you care about <laughs> your brother so much. That's why you're checking out in a few months, leaving him all alone? Shut up! No! Oh. Dean just tried to off Ruby. 
is a demon, Sam, period, all right? They want us dead, we want them dead. I remember that demon chick in Ohio, Casey. You didn't want her dead. Yeah, well, she wasn't stringing me along like a fish on a hook. I know it's dangerous. She's useful. No, we kill her before she kills us. Kill her with what? The gun she fixed for us? <laughs> Whatever works. It's not so simple. We're not, we're not just hunting anymore. We're at war. Are you feeling okay? Because you're taking advice from a demon, for starters. You seem less and less worried about offing people. You know, I used to eat you up inside. Yeah, and what has that gotten me? Wait, so, so you're mad because I'm starting to agree with you? I'm worried. Sam, I'm worried because you're not acting like yourself. I don't have a choice. Yeah. What is that supposed to mean? You're gonna die, bro. Uh, Dean, you're supposed you're leaving, to die soon. Right? And I gotta stay here in this crap hole of a world. Right. Alone. If I'm gonna make it, if I'm gonna fight this war after you're gone, then I gotta change. Change into what? Into you. <sighs> What's going on with you? I don't know. Something's wrong. The coven, man. It's gotta be the coven. <laughs> oh. I can't find it. No. Sam, what are you doing? Sam! Sam! Oh, how much time he has. Door. Oh my god! Let him go. Let who go? What are you doing? If you know about me, then you know about this gun. You're killing my brother. Now let him go. Get away from the altar. What? Now! Oh, unless it's somebody else. And they just think it's them. You want to kill me? Get in line, bitch. <laughs> Ew. Stop calling me bitch. Stop the spell or die. Five seconds. What? Four. No, please. Please don't kill us. We were just getting Renee a lower mortgage rate. Next time you point that gun at me, I'm not going to just disappear, understand? You saved my life. What was that stuff? God, it was ass. <laughs> Tasted like ass. It's called witchcraft, short bus. Short bus. You're the short bus. Short bus. <laughs> Maybe it's not you. Shh, friggin' short Who bus. You? Maybe it's you. <laughs> I don't even know what he's talking about. What are you even talking about? Everyone in your little coven, you've all had runs of good fortune. Newsworthy good fortune. Except for you, Tammy. Now tell me, why is that? You didn't want anything for yourself? Or is it because you're already getting what you wanted? Like these women's souls. <sighs> oh, she's nice the demon. demon. Let my brother go. What's wrong? Couldn't find my hex bag? Oh! Oh! <laughs> what? You're in a lot of trouble, Sam. Um... Tammy, what are you doing? Renee, shut your painted hole. Ah! What? Not in my house, Tammy Benton. <laughs> Let the girl go. Wait your turn, young man. Damn. Oh, God. You're not Tammy. No. But I'm wearing her meat. Ew! I'll break the ice with you girls somehow. Wearing her meat. You killed Renee. <laughs> Renee, Amanda, you remember all those dark demonic forces you prayed to? Just who did you think you were praying to? It was me. You sold yourself to me, you pig. Oh. All I had to do was bring one good book to book club and you ladies lined up to kiss my ass. We didn't know. Oh, yes, you did. You knew every step of the way. Sammy Winchester, wow. Right here in our little town. My friends and I, we've been looking for you. Because I'm supposed to lead some piss poor demon army. No, you're not our messiah. But there's a new leader rising in the West. Thing is, this demon, he doesn't like you very much. Doesn't want the competition. Nothing personal. It's a PR thing. Don't Bye -bye. hurt him. <clears throat> no. <laughs> Ooh, saved by the Dean. Two for one. Lovely. Wait. You made it out of the gate. What do you want, Ruby? I've been lost without you. 
take me back. That's why I let the Winchesters here. I've wanted you for so long. Y'all got a, y'all got a, You were one of my best. Y'all got a thing going on? But then again, you always were a lying whore. A lying whore? Calm down with the name calling. Jesus. Oh. Oh. You're really telling me you threw in your chips with Abbott and Costello here? I don't get it. Ow. That probably hurt. What's what's an Abbott and Costello? Come on. Get up. You've been here before, haven't you? She was one of mine. I turned her out a long, long time ago. Ruby here was a witch. Of course, that was when you were human. Oh. Didn't want your friends to know that all those centuries back you sold yourself to me. No secrets where you're heading, remember? Monyev Valak Fort. Oh no. Uru Ugirega Rua. Fish Nish Fort Fish Nish. Not the fish Nish. Oh. A counteractive spell, bitch. Ha! <laughs> no! No! Aww. Oh, oh, he really didn't like you. He got you a couple times. Shank! Stab! Bye bye! Yes. Go. I'll clean up this mess. Alright, Ruby. All right. Ooh. Go. Yes, ma'am. Right on that. As you wish. Are Sam and her going to date? I feel like he kind of has the hots for her. I feel like he kind of has the hots for rubes. Uh. That can't be very good. Oh. Devil may care after all. Is that what I'm supposed to believe? I don't believe in the devil. So let me get this straight. You were human once, you died, you went to hell, and you became a... Yeah. How long ago? Back when the plague was big. Oh. So all of them, and every damn demon, they were all human once? Everyone I've ever met. Most of them have forgotten what it means. Or even that they were. That's what happens when you go to hell, Dean. That's what hell is. Hope you never have to go. What you are. Hope I never go. Philosophy I don't want to find that out. Demon. I'll pass. Thanks. It's not philosophy. It's not a metaphor. There's a real fire in the pit. Agonies you can't even imagine. No, I saw Hellraiser. I get the gist. Oh my god. Actually, they got that pretty close. Except for all the custom leather. <laughs> the answer is yes, by the way. Yes. Same thing will happen to you. Might take centuries, but sooner or later, hell will burn away your humanity. Yeah, you can count on it. No. There's no way of saving me from the pit, is there? No. Why'd you tell Sam that you could? So he would talk to me. It's fucked up. You Winchesters can be pretty bigoted. Manipulative. I needed something to help him and get the demon fucked thing? up. Why are you telling me all this? I need your help. Help with what? With Sam. You need to help me get him ready for life without you. Fight this war. Well, that's depressing. Okay. What the fuck? No. Ruby. Dean ain't going nowhere. Why do you want us to win? Isn't it obvious? I'm not like them. I don't know why. I I wish I was, but I'm not. I remember what it's like. Well, what's like? I like Ruby. I like Rubes. Being human? Even though it was a hundred years ago? Oh, shit. So is Dean going to tell Sam that Ruby was dicking around and that she doesn't really know a way of helping? That she was just saying it to get closer to Sam? I liked that episode too. I love, uh, I love, like, when you see these common themes in all these shows or, like, common names for things like Book of Shadows for the, for the book. And I'm sure that that's, like, in lore or, you know, in history and stuff like that. So it's probably common. But it's just kind of cool being on a journey, watching all these shows and seeing, like, 
some some crossing some crossing there so um i love it i love this show uh that was another awesome episode i do like this ruby girl i like that uh, the uh, the actress that plays her too she does that role pretty well so um we'll see we'll see what happens with her in the future let me know what you all thought about this one and i'll see you on the next one bye